really random tutorial and uh, I was just requested to do like a pair how to model a pair and I'm just gonna do a simple one because I really don't wanna go too much into modeling pairs uh, okay so you wanna use a background image you could just do this without a one without a background image but I mean to get the right proportions and stuff like that so go to um, view right here background image click on that and then I already loaded one but you have to go to load then find it wherever you put or get a pair image first for us to say and then put it into a folder or something and once you find it just right click on it or left click and then select image and then once you view it from the top you'll be able to see the image and it might be too big because it's just a pair so size it down that was about right though to like one and we're not going to use a cube for a pair so delete the cube by pressing delete and then hit OK and now you want to add a uh, add mesh UV sphere right here and just press OK actually you know what let's just uh, erase that erase that let's just add a uh, add mesh cylinder I think that'll be easier okay just press OK and rotate it on the Y axis Okay, once you have it up and everything, then go back to top view, and you're going to want to um, just uh, size it down, and um, just make it uh, make it like smaller oh, okay now you're gonna want to bring it down to like the fattest part of the pair like the middle of the fattest part like and then um just size it out so the edges are touching like um, the right edges right right about there and um, that might be too hard to grab so you might want to size it out so it should look something like that okay that's probably good then you want to hit tab to go into uh, edit mode and hit A to deselect it now hit B and select all these top faces and it should look like that just go back into top view and okay hit E extrude to extrude the region and hit region and now extrude it to um, two little ways and then hit S and pull it in to size it down just follow the picture if you're not going with a picture then do what you think would look right keep on extruding the region and sizing it down and following the proportions and sometimes it might be a little bit like off like 
this side's um, going off too much, and this side you might want some more over there. So just drag the arrow, or drag it with the arrows, just to fit it. So extrude it, extrude the region, size it down, then pull it over if you need to. And keep doing that till you get to the top, pretty much. At the top, just um, you don't have to follow it exactly. but uh, something like that. And now um, we're just gonna extrude the bottom too. So hit A to deselect these ones and um, press B and select all the bottom faces <clears throat> and uh, just do the same thing for these. Just hit E extrude and just do the same thing. Okay, keep doing that. Well, for the bottom one, just um, it has to be pretty, pretty like. And you can see um, it's it's looking like a pear kind of. It's okay, but you might want to do the stem for the pear too. So go back into top view, and I'm just gonna make it all one thing. So select or press B and select the top vertices now and extrude just basically the same thing but just really smaller doesn't have to be perfect especially because the pair is pretty small and you can't see all the detail anyways. Okay. That's pretty much it. And that's pretty much the pair right there. And uh, if you want to set it smooth, just go down to set smooth. And that kind of looks like a pair. You can add textures if you want. But I'm not going to do that. This is a pretty long video already. Okay.